New Year 2023. Um, do you think? Because Jeezy has reconciled with Gucci, mm-hmm. who was one of the biggest ops ever. He is reconciled with Rick Ross. Mm-hmm. Why haven't you guys reconciled your differences yet? That's a good question. And it's a question that people got to ask him more. You know what I'm saying? You know, I, I see the stories. I see the podcasts. Of everybody always asking us. You feel me? Nobody never asked him. And, and the question oh, he come on my show. I'm asking. <laughs> the questions <laughs> they do that they do ask him is a general answer. You know what I'm saying? You know, ain't nobody asking the real questions. Mm-mm-mm. Would you be open to it? I mean, of course. We created history, bro. Like you know what I'm saying? And I honestly feel that his legacy can't be a legacy without you know what I'm saying us for sure. You feel me? For sure. Um, and that's part of the reason why I feel like his recognition had he hasn't got that right now. I've been saying that for a minute though, bro. I've been um, say, you know, I, I've been saying like you you see how beloved Gucci is. Yeah. Because he has brought so many people up, right? Yeah, yeah. He 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 was the A and R of the streets for so long, from long way to Migos, mm-hmm, the yeah. thug. He's been a part of so many things. And then you look at on the hindsight, Jeezy, he really didn't do the same thing. He didn't really open the same doors. You know what I'm saying? I mean, yeah. we, a, after y'all, he just he just kind of stepped away. Right. Yeah. Was that ever was that ever the mentality? Or I mean, I mean, because it seemed like he was about to run a pipeline back then, and then it just like just like the water ran dry. Right. Um. Mm-mm-mm. You never know what people be going through, man. And who would, who you know? Everybody have a different personality. So for me, it's like. Some things I can't see because there's just I, I wouldn't do that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Whereas you got some people that that's just who they are. You know what I'm saying? No matter how how much you want them to be different, it's just who they are. You feel me? Like it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? Um it just kinda it kinda seems kinda I don't know. I mean, given nobody owe nobody nothing. Right, of unless course. So, you know exactly. what I'm saying? We're yeah. not saying that. But it just yeah. seems kinda selfish. Where if 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 I know where my partner can go get a bag at, or I can put my partner in position to eat. Where why would I want to be the only millionaire in this company? You know what I'm saying? Like I, I always say, I want Stan to have more money than me. I want I want my guys up. I want my my artists up. I want everybody around me up. So if I ever fall, mm-hmm. y'all can catch me. Right. You know? I mean, that's how you come up in the street. But that's how Wayne did it. Yeah. When Wayne was going through his little dispute with Birdman. He he could always hop on a Drake record, hop on a Nicki, Nicki record, record, get back hot again. Yeah. But if you don't bring these these talented individuals up with you, you ain't got nothing to fall on. Yeah. Yeah. Hey man, we'll see. Maybe 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 you never know. Maybe maybe this interview will spark some things, man.